Good morning. My name is Blythe Brown. I'm glad I can speak to you, and I am excited to share my testimony. I'm glad I have brave enough to talk to you. God gave me a gift. I'm going to do it in public. I have talked as part of my job at, at Best Buddies. I answer the phones. I have worked there for 20 years. I have another job at TJ Max. I have worked there for four, four years. I get a discount too. I live by myself in my free time. I like to watch TV and I can also sing in a chorus. I play the violin. This is me on the video. Did you like the Bible story today? I did, I did. I bet the girl spent a lot of time on her temple. Her dad was one of the leaders in the story today. The girl is very sick. Her dad begs Jesus for help. Parents want to help their kids. He wants his daughter to be well. I had a, a stroke a few years ago. It was, was a bad time. I wanted to get better. My mom and my dad wanted me to get better too. I couldn't walk or talk very well. That was very hard for me to, and to see. I pray, the, I pray to Jesus to get better. And I worked hard, but look at me now. I'm okay, I'm okay. Parents look out for kid, their kids. But parents aren't the only one. Good God looks are out for us too. To be honest, sometimes I wish my mom and my dad would be not be there too much. Sorry, mom. <laughs> they they see me as a little girl. I'm fifty. Years old, I am. Um, I'm a working woman. I live my own home with with my two cats, Ben and Jerry. Do you like cats? I do. Cat lovers in the unit unite. <laughs> <laughs> I grew up in Concord. I went to to Sunday school at, at church in Wayland. I started to acolyte when I was twelve. I still serve as an acolyte. I used to go to a group like Sunny Fellowship and it closed. I'm glad I can come here now. I'm starting to, to know people here. I like to make new friends. I would like to help, I would like to like I would like to be your friend too. Uh, but you have in common. I have more in common with the woman in, my, in the Bible story that the girl, she was 12, the woman was much older. She wanted to be healed too. She had been sick for many years because she was bleeding. She could not go out in public. She could not live normal life. She must have felt bad and alone. She went up to Jesus that day because she wanted to be healed. She wanted her, her life back. She wanted to be able to live a normal life again. That's what I want to do too. I don't think anyone wants to be sick. I could wait to get back to my apartment. I have lived in my own 
upon me for 29 years, as to the best. I can watch what, what I want on TV. I can cook when I want, and I can sleep as long as I want on Saturday. I love living in my own. I'm proud of, I, I am proud I can do that. I hope the woman in the Bible story can get her, her life back to normal. I hope the little girl grew up strong and healthy women. The people who loved them who well could relax because they were never the only ones in who cared. God is always there for us. Amen. <laughs>